Hi, this is Mato. Welcome to my online chess lecture. In this video, I will show you a game between GJ van Gelder and Max Elwe. Elwe is the Dutch way of pronouncing Max's surname. So I was told. Let's have a look at the game. Gelder had white pieces and he started with d4. Max Elwe played knight to f6 c4, e6, knight to f3, and now b6, going for queen's Indian defense. Knight to c3, bishop to b7, bishop to g5, bishop to b4, e3, black to move. h6 was played, asking the bishop to decide. This move was first played in 1915 by Alekhin, and his opponent played bishop to h4, and in this position Alehin played c5. Max Elwe was first ever to play g5 in this position, not worried about his king's safety. Bishop to g3, and now knight to e4, and suddenly black is attacking. Queen to c2, black to move. Max Elwe played h5, threatening h4, winning the bishop. Bishop takes on c3 became the most played move in this position. We have h5. Gelda played h4, preventing h4 by black. g4, knight to g5. If knight goes to d2, the bishop takes on c3, b takes on c3, knight takes bishop, f takes on g3, c5, and black is better. Back to our game. Knight to g5. Knight takes on g3. f takes on g3. Bishop to e7, threatening. Bishop takes knight. f g to e4, d5. No rest for white. c takes on d5. e takes on d5. Knight to d2. Queen to d6, attacking the pawn on g3. Under pressure and being on the back foot. White decided to attack, but this backfires. Bishop to b5, a check was played. Well, castling queenside should have been considered. Bishop to b5, check, c6, Gelda castled kingside, c takes on b5, knight takes on b5, attacking the queen. Queen takes on g3, knight to c7 check, king to d8, knight takes rook. At this stage, white is even better materially. He has a rook or a bishop, but white king is feeling a wind in his hair, especially after this move. Bishop to d6. Rook takes on f7 following the principle that attack is the best defense. This is actually clearing a square for the king to escape. Queen to h2, check. King to f1. Bishop to a6, check. King to e1. Black played a move when white resigned. I guess queen takes on g2 is also good. Queen takes on h4, check. White resigned. One line goes like this. King to d1. Queen to h1, check. Knight to f1, bishop takes on f1, queen to f2, and now knight to d7, queen takes on f1, queen takes queen, rook takes queen, king to e7, king to e2, rook takes knight. And after the dust is cleared, black has two pieces for a rook and a winning endgame. I guess many people will say that white could have continued. Yes, he could have, but on the other side was Max Elwe, and White lost interest in this position. What do you think of this game? And that is all. I hope that you enjoyed watching this video. I wish you good luck with your chess and bye for now.